السلام علیکم ورحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ ویلکم ٹو وسٹم انٹرنیشنل اسکولس ڈیجیٹل کلاس روم فار میتھمیٹکس چلڈرن سو وی ہیڈ کمپلیٹڈ ایکسرسائز تھری پوائنٹ سوری یا تھری پوائنٹ فائیو رائٹ سو ناؤ وی آر گوئنگ ٹو لرن آئی مین یو نو ڈو تھری پوائنٹ سکس اوکے سو ہیئر آئی جسٹ ایکسپلین اٹ وتھ فیو ایگزامپلس اینڈ دین یو نو آئی شو یو ہاؤ دس ایکسرسائز ہاؤ ٹو گو وتھ دا ایکسرسائز اوکے سو ہیئر سی دس از اکویشن ریڈیوسبل to the linear form okay right okay so now see if the uh, question is something like this solve x plus 1 over 2x plus 3 is equals to 3 over 8 so what i can do is at uh, the simplest way is like you know go with the cross multiplication okay so i'll cross multiply that is i'll multiply the 8 with the x plus 1 and 3 with the 2x plus 3 okay so when i multiply 8 with x plus 1 i can put it over here like this either i can put it this side or that side that doesn't matter okay i can first write 3 into 2x plus 3 see this whole thing written like this 3 into 2x plus 3 is equals to 8 into x plus 1 this way or this way anything is fine okay so now anyways we'll carry on with the green work which i have done okay so 8 multiplied with the x plus 1 is equals to 3 multiplied with 2x plus 3 all right so now i'll have to distribute it 8 into x is 8x 8 into 1 is 8 right and the sign comes as it is is equals to 3 to the 6x plus 3 3 is a 9 right now let me combine the like terms bring the uh, x terms together so 8x i keep it as it is 6x i bring it this side so it becomes minus 6x now 9 i keep it as it is 8 i bring it to the other side so it becomes minus 8 okay so now 8 minus 6 is 2 so 2x is equals to 9 minus 8 is 1 so i get 1 okay now x is equals to 1 divided by 2 this is the answer so now actually so far whatever linear equations we have solved and we have got the uh, value for x we can actually do a small checking to see if you know what we have done is right or not i am just going to show you how to uh, work on with the checking okay so this is the question given to you x plus 1 over 2x plus 3 is equals to 8 and what's the answer we got we got x is equals to 1 by 2 right so now we are going to check if this 1 by 2 is right or not okay so first let me see let, i'll just write down what is lhs see the is equals to sign so to the left side left hand side that is what is your lhs okay to your left hand side lies all these things that is x plus 1 over 2x plus 3 and to your right hand side which is your rhs lies 3 over 8 okay so i have just written lhs is equals to x plus 1 over 2x plus 3 and rhs is equals to 3 by 8 okay now i am going to substitute x is equals to 1 by 2 now this is my answer what i got right so i am going to check if this is right or not so for that what do i do i take this x equals to 1 by 2 and i will substitute for the x in the lhs okay so so this is my lhs okay so for the x i have put 1 by 2 so see i put 1 by 2 plus 1 as it is divided by 2 i have written as it is and again for the x i put 1 by 2 plus 3 okay now 1 by 2 plus see now i can't solve when i have different denominators right the denominator below this one is nothing is there so i'll put 1 so i'll have to make this denominator as 2 isn't it because there is a 2 over here so let me try to make this also 2 so to make this as 2 i'll have to multiply by 2 so i'll have to do the same thing on the top also so i have 1 by 2 plus 2 by 2 then the whole thing divided by now you see the 2 and 2 can be cancelled and i simply get 1 plus 3 okay so now here i can add them see this top part can be written as 2 1 plus 2 right so i get 1 plus 2 is actually 3 by 2 so that's what i have written in the numerator divided by 4 is in the denominator so i have written 4 so now how do you do it when you divide it whenever you have see 3 by 2 divided by 4 so i can write 1 over here right there is 1 in the denominator So we have learnt in your uh, previous classes, junior classes, like how to divide a rational number. The three by two comes as it is. We, the division turns out into be your multiplication sign, and the four by one could be written as you know reciprocate it and write it as one by four. So that's what I have written. So I get three into one as three, and two into four is eight. So I get three by eight, and this is what is your RHS. Look at this. So when you put one by two for the x. and your lhs you are actually getting 
the RHS. So this is a case like you know LHS is equals to RHS. So when this kind of a case arises you can say that our solution x equals to 1 by 2 is correct okay. So this is just for our, for us to check okay you should know how to do the checking okay if they ask in the test you do it and show it otherwise if you have time you can just you know cross check yourself all right. Yeah, now we will do one problem from exercise 3.6. So look at this question number one. This is what is given to you. Solve the following equation. So here, see there is nothing in the denominator of the two, right? So we don't have to worry. We will just multiply. See, first we'll move the 3x to the other side. So it's in the denominator. So when it goes to the other side of the is equal to sign, it gets multiplied, right? So that's what I have written. 8x minus 3 I have written as it is. 2 into 3x okay so 8x minus 3 is equals to 2 into 3 is 6 and x as it is okay so now let me bring that x terms together so 8x so let me bring the 6x to this side so it becomes minus 6x is equals to now if I bring the minus 3 to the other side I will have plus 3 so this is 8 minus 6 is 2x which is equals to 3. See, when I bring the 6x to this side, I am left with nothing, right? There is nothing over here. There is just 0 remaining, right? So, 0. Now, the 3 gets added up to the 0, which gives you simply 3, okay? So, you know, I don't have to actually show the 0 written over there. So that's why I wrote the 3 directly, okay? Now, x is equals to 3 by 2. So, now we will do the checking for this also, all right? So, LHS is equals to you know what's the question 8x minus 3 by 3x so let me write down 8x minus 3 by 3x and rhs uh, no, is given as 2 so la let me substitute x is equals to 3 by 2 this is what we got as a solution so let's substitute so i will write 8 as it is for x i will write 3 by 2 here i have written minus 3 as it is from here the whole thing divided by 3 as it is and for the x i write x 3 by 2 again so this gives you see now i can actually divide this 2 ones are 2 fours are so what am i left out with i am left out with a 4 into 3 which is 12 divided by 1 in the denominator i don't have to show that right 2 got cancelled no completely so 12 minus 3 divided by now nothing cancels in the denominator so i'll have to just multiply 3 into 3 which is 9 divided by 2 now this gives you 12 minus 3 is actually 9 divided by 9 by 2 so here you see the 9 is the uh, larger number see 9 the whole thing divided by um, i mean you know divided by 9 by 2 i can actually reciprocate it so it can be written as 2 by 9 see here actually the 9 could be written as just 9 by 1 there is no denominator for the 9 the whole thing divided by 9 by 2 so now see 9 by 1 comes as it is i don't have to show the 1 in the denominator into 9 by 2 could be written as 2 by 9 okay whenever there is a division i mean rational number in the denominator you reciprocate it okay whenever it's division so now the 9 and the 9 gets cancelled and you get simply 2 so which is your rhs so since lhs and rhs are right 3 by 2 is your correct answer okay so now see there are only five questions in uh, in this exercise and one of them i have solved it so the remaining four you have to do it in your classwork okay so that's it so we are done with all the uh, main uh, thing like you know the basics of linear equations how to solve linear equations in you know in different kind of equations are given okay now in the next session inshallah we'll be looking at word problems okay so i'll tell you the rules and how to approach the word problems how to uh, start solving the application problems okay so complete this by then and uh, practice it well all right allah hafiz see you in next week yeah allah hafiz thank you